hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel so in today's video i'm going to show you how to generate a privacy policy form for your google play store application so basically whenever you want to upload and publish your application on google play store you have to provide the link of your privacy policy form of your application so today we are going to generate a privacy policy form let's start first of all open your web browser and go to this website I will put this link in the description below so you can open it directly then enter your application name here so and then here enter your contact email address in here you have to write your name now select your application type so my application is basically free so i'm going to choose the free now you have to select the op operating system of your application so it's uh, android and you can choose your effective date so i'm going to keep it as it is and uh, now choose your ownership type so i do not work for any company i'm just an individual so i'm going to choose the first one now enter your developer name developer name is basically your google developer console name so enter here your google developer console account name and now click this arrow button for the next option so if your application contains any of this you have to check but my application is simple does not consist of any of this so i'm just going to click on the next button and here you need you have uh, two things terms and conditions and privacy policy so basically we need privacy policy so i'm going to click on this button privacy policy so now you have to deploy to flycricket.com so click on this button to deploy your privacy policy form on flycricket.com you must have uh, an account on this website so i already have created one so i'm just going to log in So as you can see my privacy policy form has been deployed now I just simply need to provide this link to the Google Play console in order to publish my application so as you can see this is the privacy policy form and this is the link that you need to provide to the Google developer console account so that's it for today Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked the video. Kindly press the like button and also press the subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching my videos.